Hey everyone, in this video I just wanted to show off my new design for a forge burner that I'm playing around with and some of the problem solving that I'm trying to do. So if after watching this video any of you have any suggestions, uh, just let me know down in the comments. So you might be able to hear in the background that the forge is making this sputtering noise when it's running. It's like the flame is going out and reigniting over and over and over again. It's hard to hear in the video without cranking the volume and hurting your ears, but trust me, it's there. The noise is probably fine, but it just doesn't give me a lot of confidence about it, and confidence is everything. So at this forge you can see I've got uh, this blower here I've got from Amazon and it's stepped to a 2 inch gate valve through 2 inch pipe teed in to the propane coming from a quarter inch uh, nipple and then it's reduced to a 3 quarter inch nipple and then a 3 quarter to 1 and a half inch reducer. And I'm running it at about 5 psi and as you can tell even just at 5 psi it's about as hot as the devil's butt crack. So I started investigating what's making that sputtering noise and I'm thinking it might be the threads on um, this end cap here because I had it hooked up to a MIG tip from before but um, I have a needle valve on the gas line now so the extra reduction into the MIG tip was a bit redundant. So the reason now that I'm switching over to forced air burner is because the burner that I've been using, I made it myself a few years ago, and it was before I had a vise or a drill press or anything really that could help me make a Venturi burner accurate, like it has to be in order to work efficiently. So I'd have to run at really high PSI in my propane tank in order to get any heats that I would need. And if any of you know, running a smaller propane tank at high PSI for a long time makes it really cold, which then drops the PSI, which makes the burner less efficient. So it was sort of a, a cycle that would make me not be able to forge, especially forge weld for a long time. And there'd also be a lot of wasted propane with that. still making that sputtering noise so the next thing that I tried was removing the uh, air fuel mixing vent that I had in there which was just a twisted piece of, of thin sheet metal in order to help mix the propane and the air together. and it's still making a sputtering noise here. So the only thing I can think of is that reducing from this two inch pipe down into this three quarter inch pipe is not allowing there to be enough fuel and air in the system. And you can see that my burner nozzle is completely disintegrated over time. So with these disintegrated nozzles and not working forge now. All I can say that it's a good thing that I bought this three inch tube the other day while I was at the junkyard because it looks like it's time for me to make a ribbon burner. <laughs> 